Miss Gray Educates, brought to you by Gray Education. Hello and welcome to another story by me, Miss Gray. Today we're reading Snowball by Sue Hendra and Paul Linnick. This is from the creators of Sue Potato, so I hope you enjoy it. Miles up, all alone, on a hill looking down, a little round snowball gazed towards town. It looked so exciting he wanted to play. It was time for some fun and today was the day. If he stayed where he was in the high mountain air, he'd have no one to play with and that wasn't fair. He made up his mind to go on a mission. The town would be fun, he had a suspicion. So off snowball set with a jiggy jig jig but he didn't catch sight of the pesky brown twig. That pesky old twig caused Snowball to stumble. The poor little fellow had taken a tumble. As he skidded and bounced, what he didn't yet know was that as he rolled downwards, he'd pick up more snow. And as he rolled faster with grace and with vigour, he started to grow, getting bigger and bigger. He was picking up snow, bits and bobs, this and that. Pebble nose, sticky arms, and a sheep for a hat. Oops, said the snowball, but what can I do? Bah, cried the sheep, who was stuck on like glue. More snow piled on as he carried on growing, faster and faster, no sign of him slowing. He was boinging and bouncing, down, 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 crashing and spinning, heading for town. Rabbits and flowers were in for a squashing, and now he was heading for somebody's washing. Tumbling and twirling faster and faster. Oh my goodness, what a disaster. Some spectacles here, some sausages there, dozens of dogs and a big scary bear. Romantic couples out for a meal, an acrobat team, an electric eel. The mayor of the town, not her ladyship too. And no, Snowball, no, please don't visit the zoo. Squawking and roaring, growling and hooting, croaking and hissing, screeching and tooting. The snowball was zooming as fast as a rocket, filling with stuff like a gigantic pocket. Zinging and zagging, down, 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 bashing and smashing through the small town. Still gathering snow, he shot past in a flash, then all of a sudden on an almighty crash. Out flew a pebble, some sticks and a sheep, out came some socks and pants in a heap. Sausages, dogs and a big scary bear, a romantic couple with snow in their hair. The acrobat team, the electric eel, the mayor of the town spinning out like a wheel. And not to forget the whole of the zoo, that snowball had managed to swallow that too. After all the commotion, the scene was snow white. The end of the story? Well, not yet, not quite. And like the beginning, as this story ends, our lonely young snowball has made lots of friends. The end. Miss Gray Educates, brought to you by Gray Education.